Coach Anderson's home debut, Aggie fans were expecting high-flying entertainment, and they got exactly what they wished for. How does 604 yards of total offense sound? The ninth best offensive performance in school history. Despite the daunting offensive performance by U-State, it was the defense that shined early, as Jerome Barber welcomed JC All-American Cade Cooper to Romney Stadium. Coach Anderson pulled some magic out of his hat as the Aggies got tricky early on a 29-yard double pass from Stanley Morrison to Robert Turbin with 7.50 to go in the first quarter. That was just the beginning. Just over four minutes later, DeAndre Burrell dimed in on Michael Smith for a 54-yard strike, capping off a four-play, 62-yard drive. Robert Turbin recorded his second of three TDs on the night on a 16-yard jaunt early in the second quarter. As if Robert Turbin hadn't amassed enough offense in the first half, he took a Burrell swing past 77 yards to the house. If anyone thinks our Aggie cheerleaders aren't tough as nails, take this into account. Before the night was over, each and every one of them did 328 push-ups. A dark horse emerged Saturday night for the Aggies. His name, Michael Smith. His doings, 100 yards on 8 carries and 3 TDs. One through the air and two on the ground. As if USU hadn't proved to have enough firepower, USU wide receiver Stanley Morrison took over the fourth quarter with an eye-popping hurdle over a would-be tackler. And let's not forget his 69-yard touchdown catch and run, which capped off a 53-34 homecoming victory for Utah State. With ATV Sports, I'm Ted Stokes.